when you are in a retirement place and you have a, a, a pot of money that you're drawing from on a regular basis, you always have the risk, which is an extremely, which is a great, great risk. It is a huge risk of outliving your money. And that's always a risk. But when you look at a performance of a portfolio, folks, you always have to rem- consider that when you are taking money from it on a regular basis, and, and first, the financial advisor needs to consider this more than anybody, but you have to understand that there is a th- place where you are forced, not you, you don't even see it happening, but the financial advisor the account is forced to sell certain positions to generate the cash for you to withdraw, or they're forced to make investments that are maybe, you know, uh, different investments so that they can withdraw it easily uh, or turn it to cash easily so that you can withdraw it. And that's not in and of itself a bad thing, but the problem is that nobody wants to take accounting account for is that It could be that they are forced to sell it when the market is down and when the account is down significantly or the position that they're going to sell is down significantly. And then that they then they sell it. So they sell not all of it, but they sell a piece of it. When you do that and sell those shares at a lower price, it's almost impossible to recover. It is very, very difficult. You need a, a, an incredibly <clears throat> thriving market to get that cover, to get recovery in the account. And that's where it, the danger lies, because that's what I mean about outliving your money. So if you have another four years like that four years, or worse yet, have another eight years like that four years, you could easily be at a place where you're going to have to drastically reduce your income. 